Kanye West's ambition of living in a work of art became a reality when he bought this $57 million Malibu mansion. Let's go inside and check out this magnificent property. This home would be very different from the one he had with Kim Kardashian, his ex-wife. They shared a $60 million Hidden Hills mansion, which was enormous. West has a deep affection for Tadao Ando's art island in Japan, Naoshima, which he visited on his first trip to Japan. He once declared he wanted to live inside a James Turrell sculpture and was cited as calling it life-changing. As for Kanye, he settled for a lifestyle that's not quite possible, but he spent a stunning $57.3 million off-market for a Malibu home that's equal parts house and sculpture. It is also one of the few Ando-designed residences in the country. The world-renowned architect behind such landmarks as the Shanghai Museum of Art and the Burst e-commerce center in Paris. Kanye West was raised in a poor Chicago home by a single mother and a single father. His $1.1 billion fortune stems from a successful career as a rapper, music producer, and entrepreneur. The rapper's extravagant way of living shows just how much money he spends on things like vehicles, trips, and real estate. West has become the buzz of the town because of his just-released album Donda in August 2021 and his divorce from Kim Kardashian. Following the purchase of a $57 million bunker-style property at Malibu, he made headlines once more. Although West is renowned for spending a lot of money on real estate, his latest acquisition has grabbed the attention of the public. The Malibu house was previously sold for $1.9 million in 2003 by former Wall Street investor Richard Sachs, who is best known as Ashley Olsen's ex-boyfriend. Sachs spent millions of dollars in seven years constructing and building a massive three-story mansion that looks more like a military-grade bunker than a regular residence. According to reports, the construction required 1,200 tons of port concrete, 200 tons of steel reinforcement, and 12 60-foot pylons to keep the monstrously massive home from sinking into the sand. The land itself is fairly small, spanning around 5,700 square feet, reaching from the road to the ocean, and is sandwiched between two other residences. Local surfers and other beachgoers use the two-lane roadway in front, enjoying the relatively broad public beach and strong waves in the Pacific neighborhood area. West will save money on landscaping costs because the vaguely brutalist-inspired house has no yard and no plants. The home is split into three stories, with three guest bedrooms on the bottom floor, a communal area on the second, and West Master Suite on the third. The mansion is just around 30 minutes by vehicle over twisty mountain roads, from West and estranged wife Kim Kardashian's large Hidden Hills compound, which is still occupied by Kardashian and the couple's children. The three bedrooms on the lower floor have ensuite bathrooms, while the kitchen, living area, bathroom, and lounge with a robust fire pit are located on the middle floor. West's penthouse-style master bedroom includes a rooftop patio with a magnificent view of the beach. The house has a modernist design with clean and crisp lines, as well as elegant architecture. While it may be meant to look like a bunker, the floor-to-ceiling windows that surround it provide levity and allow the area to open out to the beautiful beach only a few feet away. Kanye has multiple residences around the country, but his current portfolio includes a sprawling ranch in a semi-remote corner of Wyoming, a brutalist-inspired apartment in Calabasas, and two minimalist condominiums in a brick New York City building, in addition to the Hidden Hills in Malibu properties. He also owns almost 300 acres of unoccupied hillside land on the outskirts of Calabasas, where he attempted to create a mystery town of dome-like dwellings in the past. While Kanye has had a hectic year, which has included greater media attention and the release of his extremely successful record, the musician has discovered a space for himself where he can live in seclusion while still admiring the architect's work. As Kanye West himself has stated, the property is a breathtaking masterpiece, and there really is no one better suited to appreciate its splendor than the rapper himself. What do you think of this garish-type home? Let us know in the comments below. I hope you enjoyed the video, and if so, then give it a thumbs up, consider subscribing to our channel, and ring the notification bell button for our latest Super Rich Daily updates. Thank you for watching, I'll see you next time.